Hello, and welcome to ALW Collectibles. Today, we're going to be taking a trip back into the world of the Beast Wars, particularly 1998 Trans Metals with Mega Class Optimus Primal. There he is. And this is his Season 2 look. He's a metallic gorilla. Couple quick notes about this. This is the blue mainline version from Hasbro. He was released in a purple variant as well. The purple variant is not as common as the blue one. But if you take a look at the two, the only difference is just the metallic coloring. Other than that, the figures are identical. They look pretty good. I like them both. So we'll transform them both, and you can take a look at them in robot mode. I'm not going to do a lot of side-by-side -side comparisons. I will for some of them, but not for all of them. Like I said before, I want each one to stand out as their own individual figure. Um, the other note to note with this one is that Takara did release their own version of this mold. All the brown on him was, relay, was replaced with translucent maroon plastic. So, let's take a closer look at him. I really do like the sculpting on this one. Optimus right here on his chest. He's got a little design right here. Great work all throughout the body here. Come down to the legs, to the arms, onto his back. I don't know how many people have actually seen the Beast Wars, but it was a very good cartoon, always enjoyable to watch. Always recommended if people want to see a new Transformer show, and they've never seen one. Articulation, absolutely nothing at the head. Shoulder goes all the way around, goes up, bicep rotation, and he has elbow bend. Nothing at the wrist. He does have waist rotation. Leg can go up. Because of this piece in the back, it's kind of hindered about going back. But if you move it a little bit, he can go back. And these do move up and down, which can help with posability, and so doesn't this. His toe. Now, I did something different with this one today. I left the weapons on him because they're usually stored on him, and you see them in the cartoon. His first weapons we're going to look at are these. These are two battle maces that he carries. These are all 5mm ports all the way around it. And he gets two of them. They're identical. The other one he has is his gun. And mine was brown. In the show, it was brown and silver, so I painted it, like I said, years ago with a couple of my other figures, just for show accuracy. Looks pretty good. It's very, very basic. And the other function for these are as missiles. They clip in when they want to, and you just push on the back. And it's supposed to fire out, but mine doesn't do it that well. This is actually what a one actually supposed to look like. Like I said, it's all brown. The only difference between my two is, like I said, I painted one versus the other. So we're going to put his accessories back on him. Now in this mode, he does have another trick that he can do, which I think is pretty cool, which was a highlight of this one. First thing we're going to do, we're going to lift him up, and we're going to turn his body to face opposite of the gun. This needs to be on his back. We're going to bring this up. Next, we're going to turn this way. We're going to bring these two down. Just like this. We're going to turn these two pieces down. Turn one 
in each direction. I'm gonna move that out of your way. Open the legs up a little bit, push these in and connect them. And now he's got a hoverboard and it does roll. There are wheel, whoop, there are wheels under here. Mine don't turn that great because of age. So now he's a monkey on a hoverboard with a booster. And he actually uses this mode in the show quite often. So it's pretty cool. I like it. I think it was a nice touch for this figure. One thing I was doing for quite a while was I was trying to do bio cards for the ones that I have bio cards. I seem to have stopped that for some reason. I don't know why, but I want to get back into the habit of that. So before I get into transformation, I would like to get into his bio card for Optimus Primal. This is the actual bio card that comes with him. He is a maximal, Optimus Primal, function, maximal, general. And the bio is as stated. Changed into a mighty metal gorilla by a planetary destruction device, Optimus Primal has a built-in rocket-powered hoverboard that lets him hang 10 on the airwaves of the beast world's world. Stronger and faster than ever. He can... Ver oh, sorry. This is where my tongue doesn't work yet. He converts to become a huge organic enhanced maximal general loaded with weaponry. Predacons who value their health best avoid any monkey business with metal Optimus Primal. And his stats were strength is a 10, intelligence was a 10, speed was a 10, endurance was a 10, or 10 plus for those, I'm sorry. Rank was a 10, courage 10 plus. Firepower, 10 plus, and skill, 10 plus. For anybody new to the bio cards for these, Transformers used to be ranked on a scale of 0 to 10 or 10 plus. So overall, he's maxed out across the board. And that's the bio card that comes with Optimus Primal. So let's get down to transformation. We're actually going to leave his all his equipment on him today. I usually take all the accessories and stuff off, but we are going to put him back to his other mode first. We're going to pop that, turn the leg, put that back on. I'm going to come to the front, set that leg, turn that, set this, flip that down on his back on this hinge here, and we're going to turn him and set him back up. All right. So now we're ready to transform him to robot mode. First thing we're going to do is we're going to lift his arms up. And I'm going to take these two side panels and pull them down. I'm going to come to his back. I'm going to lift this whole panel up and over his head straight for a minute. This just makes it a lot easier to see now. I'm going to take this and straighten it all the way out at this hinge and at this hinge down here. Bend the leg. I'm going to bring this flat. Same thing. Two hinges. One there. A second one there. Straighten his foot. Next thing I'm going to do is right here at the head, I'm going to take my thumb. I'm going to turn them around, actually, so you can see this. I'm going to push on the head and pull back on the shoulders. Popping him in half. Push his head down, lift this head up, and I'm going to close him back up. I'm going to bring his arm down, turn it around. Now I'm going to open his hand up. There's a tab right here and a tab here. Pull his hand out, rotate the hand around, close it, and do that. I'm going to do the same thing over here. Bring this down. Turn this around. Out, rotate, close, in. I'm going to turn his waist. Now I'm going to take this whole backpack and I'm going to fold it on this joint here, 
onto his back and bring these over his shoulders. And there is Optimus Primal in his gorilla mode. A couple quick notes while I have a couple seconds and I transform the other one real fast. Um, I do want to go back and do, redo some of my older videos. I'm going to keep the old ones up, just some ones I know more of what I'm doing and I want to be able to present them a lot better for everybody and have a better product out. I haven't quite figured out which ones I'm going to do just yet. If there's any suggestions, please leave down in the comments for me. But just heads up on that. Also, I wanted to let people know that I am doing short clips on Twitter. Not Twitter, I'm sorry. TikTok. Of previews of figures coming up, as well as clips of current videos that are already available. Those are already up. It's the same name, ALW Collectibles. And there's the blue version. And there is the purple version with him. And you can see the only difference is just going to be the coloration on them. But just to give it a heads up, I will be also be doing Twitch under ALW Collectibles as well. So a lot of fun things happening with this channel. Trying to grow out a little bit, explore, build up a little. But That's what's currently going on. And I am working on another live stream for next month with a lot better modding than the first one. So I will be doing another one on YouTube. Back to Optimus Primal. Let's take a look at that monkey face. I really like that. Red eyes. He's got the orange face, white teeth. He's got the Optimus Primal and Prime head design. I really, really like that. Don't mind the dust. He's been sitting on a shelf for almost 20 years. I like how these become his shoulder pads. He's got orange in the chest on top of the brown. I like how these open up for his legs and he's now become his kneecaps. And everything is all connected in here. Looks pretty cool. Nice detail work. In either form, he can hold his gun in his hand. Kind of a silly little gun for this big guy, but it is what it is. And in the show, it looked pretty cool. And again, he can hold the mate, have the mace weapon. The one time I don't expect it to fire off on me, it goes flying. Let's try that again. So he can hold it. And... I should have just shown you this when I had it out. He can hold these. Like he said, like I said, these are clubs as well. Articulation, his head in this mode does turn. No up and down. Shoulders can go all the way around. Bicep, same as before. Elbow, waist. This time he actually has a deep a knee bend. And it's cool because he can turn all the way around. And toes. And he does have the double bend there for posability. And his gun can still go up and down and be moved. He does do one more feature. It's not in shown in the instructions but he did it in the show and I'm going to show you here if you lift up these panels bring this over this was actually a mode he did in the show and I was happy to see that the toy could actually replicate it raise it up just a little bit now he's got his Gatling gun
which I thought was pretty cool looking. I like this look. I just wish these opened up like the show did. You could like slide these back and make it just look like little barrels. But you can't. But I think it looks pretty cool after, after all. So that is it. Optimus Primal Trans Metal version from 1998 with a few updates for the channel and things going on, things we're working on. As always, if you like what you see, hit the like button, subscribe if you wish. Comments are always welcome. And I am working on the live. I have some stuff I wanted to talk about and get your opinions on. Uh, in other videos, anything you want. If I have the figure, I'll see what I can do. Just leave me a message. This is ALW. Have a good day.